Um, so um, this is a workshop about the concept of Anthropocene, right? So I'm, I'm going to link my statement to this concept. Um, if we understand um, the concept of Anthropocene as coextensive with uh, modernity, um, then the revelation of the Anthropocene today via the ecological crisis is also the revelation of the collapse of uh, the epistemological separation uh, modernity uh, handed down to us and the collapse also of the modern space of uh, critique that was dialectically binding subjects uh, and objects um, and today I guess this collapse that doesn't keep um, the subject immune from our objective reality anymore uh, is the ground for our uh, contemporary uh, reality under advanced capitalism. Um, it's something we could call uh, an epidemic uh, of things, uh, a sort of uh, contamination of our present by things, um, where um, it seems that our thought uh, is not able to uh, follow the accumulated avalanche of uh, events or seems to be blocked by the comprehension of um, objective complexity that is overflowing with uh, factors, networks and, and events um, and where everything seems to be equally something. Um, this is what we could call um, an epistemological panic um, in which distinguishing this from that or excluding this <laughs> from that comes down to equally making this or that into something no more and no less than something else um, and there does there there seems to be no such thing as a negative operation possible anymore no such thing as the possibility for an epistemological separation um, and I think that um, this panic, epistemological panic, uh, transforms any attempt uh, to represent or to be in a reflexive configuration towards the ground we try to express um, into a kind of uh, cash register where um, the declaration of exception of something uh, amounts to ultimately its inscription into the check um, and I guess that this situation epistemological situation sheds light on the fact that a criticality that is often asserted as the requisite of contemporary art um, might just be uh, maybe another contribution to our objective complexity or the added value of its procedures um, so counter to this, uh, what I'd like to propose, that is kind of my statement here, um, is to think art under the condition of uh, this epistemological panic um, and think ways with art to uh, slice through and, and cut off uh, this constant accumulation of things in order to uh, perceive their um, polyvocal qualities.